People and Places, question number seven. In which TV series does Clive Owen play Derek Love, the leading character? The series was Chancer. Okay. People and Places, question number eight. Which Oscar-winning actor is married to Sinead Kuzak? Difficult one, difficult one. Jeremy Irons was the answer. I will get him back for that, I promise you. Thank you. People and Places, question number nine. Which is... This is... What they, what, they, what they don't realise is this is actually the prize for whoever wins tonight. Especially, especially organised by Ray. Let's move on. Which is the most southerly province, because we're only on number nine on people and places, which is the most southerly province of Portugal? Is it the Algarve, Estremadura, or Baixo Alentejo, or however you want to spell it? It's the Algarve. Thank goodness it's not the last one. All right, people and places, question number 10. Tony Scoggins for, was elected as a Labour councillor for Nosy in May 1991. Plays which character in Brookside? The answer is Matty Nolan. Okay, there we go, question. There we go, question. There we go, that's one more section. Excuse me. <laughs> excuse, me, excuse me. Always the gentleman. Do you remember when your mum always used to say, carry, carry, always wear clean pants the best, always carry a clean hanky just in case you... Suzanne, you made an old man very happy. Right, we have one more section to do, and let's find out a winner. Okay, it's general knowledge, it's question number one. What did learned drivers first have to display on their vehicles in 1935? Easy one, L plates. Question number two, which animal is known collectively as a mob? Is it kangaroos, monkeys, or hyenas? The answer, kangaroos. All right, the question that you like so much. Which pop group took its name from a sex aid in William Burroughs' novel, The Naked Lunch? It was Steely Dan. Have you ever heard of a Steely Dan? What? If anybody knows what a Steely Dan is or does, if you could write to us, please, at Sportscast, to Peter, our floor manager, who collects things like that? He'd be very grateful. Thank you. <laughs> he's actually here. He's, he's the one you, you may have glimpsed briefly. Who's, who's running away? Where are we? This, this is Peter. Who is going to read the next question? He's the one that cleaned me up just then. What was the name of Harvey Smith's first famous horse? Farmer's Boy. I think that deserves a round of applause. General knowledge, question number five. Which unlikely astronomical event provided a chart-topping single for the Marcells? Which unlikely astronomical event provided a chart-topping single for the Marcells? General knowledge, question number six. We've only got a few more to go. On board which US battleship did the Japanese surrender in September 1945? Was it Maine, Missouri, or Florida? The answer was Missouri. Missouri, good answer there. Question number seven. Who said on his return to the saddle, it's always the same, one leg ain't kind of the horse? Lester Piggott. Only a couple to go. General knowledge. 
Who wrote the Searchers hit Needles and Pins and King Khan's hit Betty Davis Eyes? Was it Bert Bacharach, Jackie DeShannon or Tim Hardin? It was Jackie DeShannon. Two questions to go. General large question number nine. Who did Admiral Dönitz briefly succeed as Führer of Germany? It was Hitler. And the last one, Suzanne. How much in new money is the old coin known as the florin worth? And it was 10 pence. 10 pence. Well, that is it. The question is, who is going to be a winner? Are you ready? Let's count down. Add them up very quickly, wherever you are up and down the country. This is the series for the night. There are 40 questions. Let's see how many out of 40 you have got. Adam up, we'll give you a couple of seconds to do that. Don't forget, tomorrow night, right here on Sportscast, 9.40. Different time for the rugby. A little bit later than normal, 9.40. And then on Thursday, we have boxing from Barking. But that starts at 8 o'clock. Now, it's the chance of winning a trip to Florida. Are we ready? Let's run down very quickly here in Cuddeth. 40. 39. 38, 37, 36, 35, this is for you wherever you are, 34, 33, 32, 31, 30, we've got to find a winner now, 29, you said it, 28, 27, 26, 26, we, do we have a 26? Come on around the corner, sir. Come on around here. We have a winner of 26. We have a winner of 26. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, well done, sir. Right. Kev. Hello, Kev. Yeah. Well done, sir. Congratulations. What? Yeah, but you did that before. Yeah, yeah, right. Well done. You know that horrible sort of T-shirt that was covered in... Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. yeah. We haven't got you that one. We've got a nice, new, clean one. There we go. Well done. Congratulations. Well done. Our thanks to everybody here. Don't forget. Don't forget, we've got a second prize for you. Come here. This is... This is Derek, who is my present to Suzanne for the night. This is, I hope you two will be very happy together. All right? It's made, it's made your night, hasn't it? Yes. Yes, it's a bit like the end of a boxing match. It's a bit noisy, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Do you understand me? Yes. Good. Thank you very much for having us. Thank you. Good. Thank you very much indeed. Tell you what we'll do. Tell you what. That's for you. Because it goes so well with the outfit, don't you think? Yeah, I mean, oh, and a kiss. Oh, I thought you should. Oh. By the way, the landlord is giving away a trip for two to Disney World for tonight as well. All right, so that's so congratulations to our winner over there. All we've got to say is thank you to everybody here at Daly's for a terrific night. Don't forget, next week we're on the road. We're going to Hull, to the Crown in Hull. So we shall see you there from Suzanne and from me and from all the team. Till next week. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching British Aerospace Sportcast.